Godzilla slowly devouring a school bus full of children is not what we're gonna be watching today. That would be crazy, but it, it just no. It's actually Spider Godzilla versus Godzilla made by the amazing EGM channel who makes like the most insane stop motion videos ever. It still looks crazy. It's a Spider Godzilla, but I don't know if he's gonna eat a bus full of children. That one's still in the air. Make sure to subscribe to EGM for more amazing stuff and leave a like if you guys are excited for Godzilla vs Kong 2. They're officially getting filming started in Australia, dude. It's going down. Legendary Godzilla vs. Spider Godzilla. Oh my god, I feel like Spider Godzilla's gotta win, right? Because it's like Godzilla, but with spider mandibles? Well, spiders have like insane super strength for their size. I guess Godzilla's pretty beefy too. But spiders, like, have you ever seen Spider Man? I love these cities. Oh my god, it burrows from the deep. It's so extra and so awesome. I'm cheering for this thing. I love you, Godzilla, but when he sings, you know, it's it's you, but with claws, or spider-like things. Oh my god, people live there! Jesus. Jesus Christ. Look at that, dude, he's got spikes growing out of his shoulder blades. He's got those things. Yeah, Godzilla, with his power to sense the presence of any kaiju on the surface, would immediately identify this threat. Oh my god, what a gangster way to enter! Wow, that was so extra above and beyond. This channel's insane. Godzilla, huh? <laughs> Dude, there's no way that thing's gonna lose! Oh my god. It's scarier than Godzilla's roar, so... You just don't know. Oh my god! Woo! Dude, he's getting his ass whooped right now. Oh, that's so disrespectful. That's like the most disrespectful way to throw somebody. It's making me burp a lot. Dude, this thing's abilities are so above and beyond. It's acts absolutely insane. It's like Dr. Octavius Godzilla. Oh my god. Those were apartment buildings. There were kids in there. This is way worse than I thought it'd be. Oh, he's knocked out, dude. What is that dog, you demon? Good god. I'm gonna start going to church if that thing's waiting for me down there. <laughs> Okay, see, I was wondering if he has atomic breath or if the atomic breath will be the ultimate decider. It gave him chest fuzzies! Oh my god, he's getting cooked! I guess it comes down to what's better in combat, giant spider legs or atomic breath. Dude, he's getting mad fuzzies! Oh my god! Without the arm, he is but a freak! I try and play with my figures like this and the heads just pop off. Like, I don't know what's- Oh my god! Oof, his tail's got more spikies though. Damn, dude, Godzilla got knocked the f*** out. <laughs> <laughs> These are cinematic masterpieces, bro. Even with one of those arm things, he's still, he's still so advantageous. What is he doing? Is he growing more? Oh my god, now he's infinitely more powerful. I don't know, Godzilla. I don't know what you're gonna do. He simply has far too many. <laughs> hey, screw it, there's nothing, nothing you can do. If this thing has any sort of atomic breath, okay, I was, it's with the help of humans, Godzilla may be able to win. Sometimes Godzilla needs some human help. Sometimes humans make it worse, like fighting Monster Zero with the Oxygen Destroyer. But sometimes we make it better, like in the comics when Emma helps Godzilla beat Muto Prime. Oh god! Oh man! This is a snuff video, dude. He's just getting massacred right now. Oh, oh. What was that? He's like stab him in the side and disable his breath. That's insane. Theoretically, if you like poked a hole in his dorsal spikes, it would leak out of there. Oh 
Oh my god. Dude, those are studs up there. And those jets landing those shots. Godzilla just saved everybody. <laughs> There's a lot of civilians dying in this video. I like to imagine each of these windows has a family in it. It's just the saddest thing ever. But that's the realism. Those are apartment buildings. But the beast ain't going down yet. Oh, God! This regeneration is insane. What's Godzilla gonna do? That's the one thing they can't grow back, right? It's gonna be the head. Oh my god, it's developed atomic breath. All is lost. Yo, and it's like some crazy Shin Godzilla fluffy breath. Oh god. It's mega. Dude, he's just getting slammed. Like, god, that, was, that was so well done right there. I'd love to see something like that in a movie. But Godzilla hasn't faced anything with atomic breath yet. Powerful enough to do such a thing in the in the monster verse. Out of the fluffies! Damn, that was so gangster. I've not seen any way to permanently damage this creature aside from ripping its head off. I feel like, oh god. <laughs> Where they just fall to like the the hollow earth. Oh sh That is what happened. I would imagine some sort of Godzilla erected prospering so much in the hollow earth. Such agility with those things. Prospering anywhere, really. It would be hard to get back up. You gotta find one of those portals. Oh my god! Oh Jesus! This is so one-sided. Thank God for that atomic breath. It's just, it's just such a lifesaver. It looks so mighty, dude. This should be like a toy commercial. Hey, I don't want to download that effect. <laughs> The beam clash would be mighty between these two. I would expect the spider Godzilla's breath to almost win just because it seems so like unstable energy. Oh my god. Oh sh That's how you do it, right? Oh my god, yeah, Z, remove the head, the thing and can't grow back. When in doubt, rip it out. That's the Godzilla motto. Dude, that was insane. There was really no other way for him to win that. The regeneration was too much, but Godzilla's got, I guess what it comes down to, he's got too much fighting experience. Like, dude, I just ripped the head off a demon. Oh my God, is that Ultima? Clearly it is. That's crazy. I love Kong, but Ultima would dust his ass, dude, for sure. I love how each of these always includes like a separate battle after. It's like a surprise thing at the end. I wonder if Kong would even be able to survive that. Oh my god, that like crazy gaseous red smoke stuff. Is he gonna rip his face open? Oh my god, this is crazy. What? That would have to be one huge mega monkey. I guess I want Kong to win. Like, I do cheer for Kong more than Ultima. Kong at least relates to humans a little bit, he like talks to people. Oh my god! <laughs> that was so aggressive. That's kaputs. I love you, Kong, but that's kaputs, right? That's like a. You'd be so jacked up after that. Oh god! Yeah. Oh god! Oof. Yeah, he'd be singeing those fingers. Dude, his fingertips would be sick, but he'd be alive. Such cool cinematography. Book it, monkey! Smart man. Way more agile than Ultima, he'd be able to get around. 
Yeah, that'd be terrifying. Such cool camera work. This whole thing's so genius. Oh, God! I guess it is still hard for Kong to hide. He's like a 300 foot tall monkey, for God's sakes. But he's so agile, I imagine. His bite's gotta do more. He's got a primate mouth. Woo! I hope he books it. He's in so much danger right now. Oh god! See, but Ultima's got way better reach in than Kong does though, man. There's so much on the line. Those big monkey fangs! What a bad ass! I'm gonna walk over like, oh my god, like he's just in charge. I cannot stress it enough though, Kong needs to get out of there. These momentary lapses of victory shall surely be removed. He's in so much trouble now, clearly that thing's on the rampage. I'm, I just, oh my god, he smacked his ears. He did the thing. That's the, <laughs> that's the most evilest thing you can do to somebody in a fight. He busted his eardrums, dude. Ultima is deaf now. Oh my god. <laughs> dude, this is, the, this is the most diabolical thing I've ever seen in my life. Oh god! Look, like, I'm going- this <laughs> He f***ed up. What is even happening anymore? He'd be dead, right? Like, for sure dead. Well, he put up a fight, but that's still the most horrific thing I've ever seen. I'm not- I'm not moving- Oh, God! What, is he stabbing his toes into him? It's insane how detailed these fights are. I, I, I forgot of a stop motion. Oh, my God! Ripped his arm off, dude! Jeez, I'm crepes. Even with a destroyed butthole, he's able to do so much. A tree. His own favorite weapon. Dude, all armless over here. Good God. I don't know who I'd rather be though. Have an exploded butt or one arm. They both sound pretty awful. But at least one doesn't need a special toilet. Oh my God. Ultima is getting destroyed right now. Where's it going? Oh, dude, that hit his face. Oh, God. Oh, God. That is one dangerously dead monkey. Oh, right through the forehead, dude. That arm will regrow, right? Yeah. Obviously. Oh, not in this universe. That is one dead lizard, bro. Oh, my God. That is gnarly. This, this was one of the most epic fights I've ever seen in his stop motion. This channel's legit godly, dude. And you know what's crazy? This is the most intense thing I've ever been emotionally involved in, and it wasn't even the point of the video. There was a whole other giant battle before it. I've already almost forgotten about because of how intense that was. These two! My god, this channel! This channel blows your socks clean off, dude! If you haven't already, subscribe to EGM for the most amazing stop motion videos to ever exist. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>